AFTV, um, that was a big, big and impressive win by Arsenal tonight. King Arteta, he did it so, I'm so happy Robbie. Mm. Seven years, seven years and the end, let's be honest, when it was seven years ago, we were just happy to be in the group stage, get out of the group stage. This is a team that can go all the way. It's a very, what I saw today. Steady, steady. Like, no, no, steady. no, no, but no, but look at that. Let's be honest, if I was to be Paul Merson, that could have been 20 nil with Robbie. That could have been 20 nil. That's how it was. We should have scored about 10 goals in the first half. We've got the best striker in Brazil, in Gabriel Jesus. He was unreal. And they've got mm. Richarlison, and they talk about what Neymar, Neymar's passed now. Jesus is the number one Brazil striker. And you saw it today. He was brilliant. For me, he was probably man of match, maybe Odegaard. Mm. But he was absolutely brilliant. It was so, yeah, come, come such, a, such a pleasure. Such no, a pleasure. It, it was an outstanding performance by by him, by Odegaard, by Trossard. I mean, Trossard, did, did, again, I said it to a guy earlier, we, we forget that Martinelli's out at the moment. This guy, Trossard, he's looking good, isn't he? Well, Trossard, I said, should start above Havertz. Obviously, with the Martinelli, and he, uh, um, I'm not going to go into Havertz today because mm. I thought he did all right. Let's, mm. let's be honest. I think it was such a perfect mm. performance from everyone played really well. David Rea as well. Mm. The guy is like Magneto, just catching everything. Mm. But I do want to give a shout out to Ramsdale. Because without Ramsdale, we wouldn't have got this far, yeah? Mm. And his time will come, but I just think the composure at the back, and we, we should start, I think, David Ray in the North London derby. Ooh. Yeah, two clean sheets, mm. composed. Do you know what I mean? Uh, you've got to go with the winning team. Mm. For me, that's, that's what I think. I mean, what, what, was, what, would, you, what would your thoughts be on it? I, I get a feeling he might bring Ramsdale back in. Just because Ramsdale, I don't know, man, the North London derby feels like the type of game that he'll excel in, yeah. you know, but listen, if Raya starts, he, he's, he's looked very, he hasn't been tested yet, has no. he, in the two games, but he looks like a guy that's composed. But his positioning is brilliant. Like, yeah. I, like as much as I love Ramsdale, I think last year in Europa, when he got chipped, Arteta must have seen that. Do you know what I mean? Mm. We need that composure. We need, all right, go forward, but don't go out off your line so much. Don't lose goals in the first few minutes. Do you mm. know what I mean? That's composure. That's being switched on. Ray has got that. He's, I think he's got some Jamaican blood in him because that guy is seriously <laughs> cool, bro. Like, Raya is cool. Like, he's a, he's a cool guy. You know what I mean? And stuff. But it's not just that. Let's give a big shout out to King Arteta. You know, we mm. talk about, I talk about Arteta all the time, but. He is King Arteta that has got us this, uh, this far and he's developed it. We're talking, you're talking to Stricto about Odegaard. Odegaard reminds me of when Burkamp came. Do you remember when Burkamp mm -hmm. came? His confidence was shattered. Mm. We knew there was a great player and, you know, he was developed at Arsenal. Odegaard, I get that same vibe from him, you know, and I feel that Odegaard can be even better. Vieira, he's developed Vieira. Gabriel mm. at the back. Saliba, he sorted out his attitude. Look how good. This is what the culture you know mm. we talk of this buzzword culture this is what Arteta's bought so we've got to give a big clap to King Arteta you know Definitely. you know and I'm really how, really pretty proud how far can we go in this competition finally uh, listen I said I think we can I said to Cecil a couple years ago when I first came on AFTV I said we're gonna smash the Champions League we didn't quite make it that year but I think had we made it we would have smashed it last year mm. we were brilliant last year let's not mm. forget that I think this year if we can keep injury freeze Saliba and Tommy mm. Asu was both on the same day when they got injured again in that Europa League. If we can keep injury free, we've got a bloody good squad. You know, when you look at the squad that yeah. we had and the people that we could bring in, I just hope they stay fit. I think we can, we can, we could potentially go the way. If Inter Milan can get to the final, do you know what I mean? Who knows? Who knows? 